Yes, Isabel said. Thank you, Thomas said, and he began to cry with you. Isabel radio start beeping. Beep, 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 beep. And she answered, Isabel is speaking. This is the military commander, Mick, and his troop requesting to te teletransport from the block base. Coordinates free, Isabel said. Then one by one of the hearts appeared in the house. Ah, they all said they look outside the window at the beautiful papas of snow were falling in the distant little town. They went outside to touch it. After their quiet celebration, um, uh, they start singing, Stardust from the sky, can't really help you. After their quiet celebration of the snow ended, they started to dance a mini song called Meanwhile, Thomas was inside the small house singing, I really, really need money. To buy a bread and honey, when we lie on her, so money. Me follow him inside after Thomas stopped singing. Me talk to him. Tell me about yourself, Commander Me asked. Well, I don't have a job right now, but I just apply at the new library for a job. I wish you luck, he said. Isabel radio sounded again. There is an emergency, Isabel said. We have to return to Love Base. They all rose in their tiptoes and disappeared. When they returned, they had bad news. A meteorite is going to hit the Earth, said Isabel. Unless we do something, it will crash, Mrs. Fancy said while doing her eyelashes. We will have to use the Earth on Love Base and blast the meteorites. 